Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for a moment of silence. Good morning, Sutton High School. Today is Monday, October 26, and it is National Pumpkin Day. Welcome back to in-person schooling. Our new hybrid model starts today. See Mr. McCarthy's letter for changes to our schedule. The Sutton Athletic Booster Club is launching a student contest immediately in search of a new and improved logo or design graphic for our online spirit wear fundraiser. The contest is open to all current Sutton students. We know we have some great talent out there and a low healthy competition may lead to some excitement at this less than exciting time. You must be a Sutton student, must include the word Sutton, must be submitted via email to sutton.sabc at gmail.com by October 28th by 5 p.m and it must be school appropriate. The winner will receive spirit wear. And now off to Maya. Hey guys, on Thursday afternoon, both boys golf and girls field hockey took the win for Sutton High School. Good job guys. Boys golf will be playing Millbury at Blackstone National Golf Course at three. Boy girls soccer will be playing Oxbridge High School today at Sutton High at three and boys soccer will be playing Oxbridge High School at Oxbridge High School at three also. Now over to Sophia for the weather. Thanks, Maya. Today is going to be 54 degrees with a high of 59, and it's going to be cloudy with some rain showers. That's too bad, Sophia. We were so lucky to have had such warm weather so far into October. Yeah, it seems like it's going back to fall weather. In news, uh, the third and final presidential debate was on Thursday night. Um, the debate was better than the first, and most news companies agree that there was no clear winner. Now over to Aiden for special segment. Thanks, Matt. I interviewed Ms. Corn about the reopening at school, and this is what she said. So hybrid 2.0 is different than the first two weeks of hybrid. Um, this time around, you'll have two in-person days of instruction and two Zooming in days. So for example, cohort A attends school on Monday and Tuesday, and on Monday and Tuesday, cohort B would be Zooming into their classes. And then you flip it on Thursday and Friday, cohort B attends school in person, and cohort A is Zooming into the classes. So you get four days of instruction. And it's very similar to the remote learning format that you're doing right now. Um, and now there's a cohort C um, that those kids are zooming in four days a week. So there are some changes. Okay. Thank you, Ms. Karn. So in a nutshell, co cohort A and B will have two in-person days and two online days. Cohort C will have full, uh, four fully remote days and uh, it will change depending on what's going on. Um, now over to Grace with uh, the end. Have a great day, students.